and we're in heaven. <laughs> Straight up the flight to the shenanigans or whatever. Let's go. Hey y'all, welcome back. Oh my god, I'm too hyped. Y'all keep coming back and I love y'all. Period. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The girl's got her hair done. The girl's back. The girl got her nails done. And Valentine's Day is three days away. And you know, I'm in the mood for love. I'm in the mood for, you know, like. So we're gonna take our talents back to Paris. Period. And I always want to be in Paris for Valentine's Day. So. We're going to Paris and I did my makeup this today because I had like extra time. So I was like, you know what? Let me do a little face look, 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 look a little cute for y'all. Look like a little sum. Cause I'm about to go to Best Buy and get a SIM card so I don't run out of memory because that's what happens all the time. And I'm never able to vlog everything on my vlog. I'm trying to make my vlogs a little longer also. So. Hey guys. I got you. I Yeah. Anything else? Um, like that. What's out there? Small, medium, large. Got my SIM card in the airport. Just got me from Starbucks. I'm about to go to TSA. I gotta finish before I go through TSA. T. This is T. Go get you one of these. Hi. Hi. What? Here, you know, if you 
few months ago, no, with me. Yeah. Oh, June. June. Yeah. Exactly. Wife, did take care of you? No. no. Are you helping Who someone? Right? Okay. I have fifty thousand dollars. You know what you want? I'm looking for classics. The classics. Yeah. Okay. Wow, my face recognition is really good because I seen his face and like I kept looking at him, but I couldn't remember like where he was from because I saw him here a couple months ago. He helped us. Okay. Thank you. What about colors? Have you? Are you open for colors? Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Or are you looking for black? Open the colors. Okay. Hey guys, so. Had a dinner at Giraffe. Okay, so I'm here at Giraffe. Lots of ravioli. Lots of linguine. Okay, guys, so I'm here at Giraffe. I just finished eating. I had lobster ravioli and I had lobster linguine. And I'm gonna give this restaurant a two out of five because the food is not all that. And I feel like this restaurant is really for like the outside seating where you like see the Eiffel Tower while you're eating and stuff. Daytime vibe and nighttime vibe, but yeah, this isn't it. And I will so guys, I just left the giraffe restaurant. I'm about to go get some hookah at this lounge. Uh, I was trying to catch the last lighting of the Eiffel Tower, but I missed it. So again, I'm gonna catch us tomorrow. <laughs> Day in Patty. I'm going bag shopping right now. I'm on a mission today. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Celine. I'm walking to a consignment shop. Oh, y'all cannot read this for shit.
hey guys i am back in my hotel room i just finished doing my makeup um it is 11 30 i'm about to catch the last light show of the um the Apple tower and take some pictures really quickly and yes this is the with like a little leather trench coat oh and by the way your girl found her valentine's day yeah. well you guys i'm gonna go take some pictures but it's how i go tower and probably go out to like a strip club or something the next my last night in paris um tomorrow i'm going to italy uh -huh. <laughs> guys i'm sad why did i miss the last light show of the night <laughs> the last light show was at 11 o'clock and i got here at 11 45 that just blew my but it's okay i'll be back several times after this so <laughs> happy valentine's day all right hey guys I just got back to my hotel just came from dinner I was really upset because of the I missed the last light show of the Eiffel Tower and yeah it's one o'clock in the morning and I have a flight at 6 a.m. to Milan so I have to be at by 4 a.m. to get to the airport in time I meet my face bad. Hey guys. After two minutes late, I'm flying on my flight to Italy. It's about an hour and a half away from Paris. When I go to Italy, I'm renting cars. Drives to my hotel. My hotel is four hours away. It's like in the mountain. Laptops must be safely stored for takeoff. If you become aware of any electronic devices. I'm at the airport. Um, I'm about to pick up our rental. All right, so we got a BMW X3. They took my car. That's a Maserati. I had to switch to this because this car has winter tires. And since I'm driving up in the mountains, where, well, the Alps, the Italian Alps, where like the snow a lot and the roads are like very icy and they suggested that I get a car with winter tires because those are not winter tires so I'll be up there ice skating it's a three hour and 20 minute drive up there and so it's like what one o'clock now my flight was delayed I was well, it was two o'clock now so I should get up there around like 5 p.m. So I'm gonna see you in a few. Pray for me, cause you're about to be whooping up, whooping up, whooping up, whooping up, and I'm out this bitch. Okay, period. So I just got to the health test. It's getting real bougie. Like they got Lambos out here, G wagons. Ooh, infinity pool. Yes. This is so pretty. Oh wow.
So this is where I'm gonna have breakfast at. I'm waiting for them to bring it out. Nah, look how my makeup is really tight. All right, guys. So this is the breakfast in bed outside. It's one of the experiences at this hotel. Of course, it is an additional cost, but this is so cute. Okay, so um, I'm about to do another experience here. I'm about to do the dessert in my like, hot tub kind of vibe. So yeah, that should be cute. Look how cute this is, guys. I don't know, like I really like love log cabins and stuff like that, so. This is just so cute to me. All right guys, so this is the hot tub. It's a little found, found do something going on over here. Yes, everything is an experience here, guys. And it was nice enough to book this for me. And this is like a cute little log cabin type of thing, chalet to be exact. I'm gonna have some dinner in here in a few. This is so cute, oh my god. I love this. And this is the heated pool, infinity pool. Good morning, guys. Today is my last day here. I'm going to have breakfast. Then I'm going to come back upstairs, shower, and pack. Also, I forgot to mention, if you guys decide to come here, I would definitely recommend renting a car. Whatever airport you land in, rent a car to come here. Because if you don't rent a car, you're going to end up spending almost $1,000 in euros just from coming, or just on a round trip from this hotel back to the airport. So. And renting a car is about what, like three, three to four hundred dollars. So that's a big saving right there. Or any hotel in this area. And oh my God, guys, I'm breaking out. I don't like that. I fell asleep with my makeup on. I think it was yesterday. I was like too tired. I hate when that happens though, because I already know. Any time I sleep with my makeup on, it's like a automatic breakout. I need to stop doing that. That's dirty gal something. But yeah, guys, I had an amazing stay here. I would definitely come back. I would definitely recommend this hotel to you guys. I love to hear their service, 10 out of 10. Their accommodation, 10 out of 10. Their food, 7 out of 10. I think my only con here was them taking so long with the food. Like breakfast, an hour wait. Dinner, an hour and a 45 minute wait just for the food. But other than that, everything is like good. And the only reason why the food takes so long here is because they literally cook in this small, very small kitchen on this very small stove. And this weekend was a really busy weekend for them because you know, it was Valentine's Day. 
everybody's here celebrating love you know so that was really busy i didn't i don't know if they even expected to be this how busy there was this week but i mean this is a popular hotel so i'm pretty sure they expected that but they definitely need like a bigger kitchen because they take really long with the food but that's my only con literally my only con oh and mostly everything i did at this hotel is considered an experience that you have to book so make sure if you guys come here make sure you guys book your experience in advance thankfully i was in contact with the social media management um of this hotel so they offered me a lot of services here at this hotel to um create content and you know stuff like that but yes guys make sure you book your experiences it's very important they have so many experiences here yeah guys i love to hear and don't mind me i look a little crazy right now yeah that's about it i'm about to go get breakfast and yeah that's it for now see you guys here it was so nice right now i'm about to drive back down to the city that's gonna be about like what a three hour drive it's one o'clock now so i should get back to milan around like four o'clock i would say hopefully sooner if there's no traffic and yeah shout out to them they really accommodated me to the best of their ability being this is a very popular Super booked hotel, so make you guys come check them out. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon. here at five o'clock so it's about like what like three and a half hours i'm about to check into my hotel and i'll probably hit the city in a while Hi, and he's 
Milano Street, no cathedral. That's that good up mall back there. That's a legendary mall. I'm about to take y'all to right now. All right, guys. So we in one of the most historical malls in Milan. This is like the original, like all the original first stores, like here. I'm about to go in here and get me some Mac rooms. Motel Milano. Oh, so this is not automatic. This shit is embarrassing me. It didn't open? You just got me out looking stupid. Hookah vibes, hookah vibes. like a 10 hour flight straight to New York. Mm -hmm. I didn't sleep all night just so that I could get some sleep on this plane because I'm right back into auntie mode. Period. Got my first baby with me. Got my third baby with me. Back 